Are you always this stupid as this a special occasion? Concentrate, Teresa. That's it. <laughs> Try a taste of your own medicine! Gary! She's not the boss of me. Calling her stupid is an insult to stupid people. Hey, would you look at that? Unless you're Odysseus Incognito, that's not your helmet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Enough of the wisecracks. Ah. <laughs> and they say it's hard finding good help these days. <laughs> <laughs> Save me from this exercise. <laughs> Where'd you learn to wrestle like this? <laughs> from Hercules. <laughs> uncle, uncle, uncle. <laughs> no surprise. And the wiener is Harry. <sighs> Okay, who wants another round? What happened to you? Gary got me right between the eyes. Mm, lose the bandage, honey. I've got some concealer you can use. Ugh, somebody's gotta put a cork in that bottle imp. Well, if my telepathy gives us an edge over Cronus, then a little bruise is no biggie. Ugh, but yeah, if I ever get my hands on that Gary, C2. It. And you've never heard word of it? I've been around before Hercules was in Tigris. I told you, all those arrows were destroyed. Hmm. All except one. J9. Miss. F5. Ah! Stop my Atlantis! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Gary, I've given you back your powers. I can just as easily take them away. Hmm. The helmet that empowered Odysseus to sneak into Troy unseen. Perhaps it has some use after all. I call on the cunning and deceptive giver of that gift. I call on the Prince of Thieves! <laughs> Big whoop! You made the helmet float. If you pull my finger, Cronus, I can conjure a gut Cronus, why have you taken me out of my time? I have need of your special talents, Autolycus. <laughs>
what's in it for me. Immortality. Hmm, an apple from the Garden of Hesperides. What is it that you seek? You're clear. Good morning. Connect you. Wait, hold on, hang on. No, no, I gave you the message. Excuse me, but who's the messenger god here? Oh, fine, call again. Looks like there's been another robbery, this time at a university lab. A lab? Archaeology lab. Uh, that's like a half dozen break ins now. And you'll never guess what was taken. Arrows, again. Do you think it's Cronus? I doubt it. This guy's too subtle. I'll say, none of the security cameras picked up anyone coming or going. Nothing? No fingerprints? No clues? Nope. These robberies were executed perfectly. Perfectly? Why that? Uh, oh, that's terrible! Uh, excuse me. Arisa. Arisa. Stop shouting! Uh, okay. Were you having another vision? No, it, there was this voice and... Never mind. I guess I was just hearing things. This is not Hercules' arrow. The arrowhead was dipped in Hydra's blood, which has a distinct pungency that does not diminish with time. The Hydra's blood is lethal, even to an immortal. Then imagine what it will do to a mortal. I did some data mining of all private and public collections holding ancient Greek arrows. Here are the thieves' next possible targets. I don't get it. What's so special about these arrows, anyway? Hey, Teresa? What can you make of these addresses? <laughs> this is the thief's next target. Archie, get Harry and Neil on the PMR and tell them to meet us there. Guys? Hermes was in my vision. Helping us out? No, not exactly. Hermes was stealing the arrow? Hermes is one of us. Maybe that third eye of yours needs some shut-eye. I know what I saw. Boo! <gasps> it's not funny! <laughs> okay. Freak out much? Are you sure you're okay? I mean, you did get bumped in the head pretty hard. Okay, forget about me seeing Hermes and all this other weird stuff. We know where the next target is. Teresa is right. We need to find out what these thefts mean. There's way too many questions and we need some answers. Careful, guys. The place is totally wired with alarms. Time to spray it, not say it.
Chelsea. Let's hurry. Teresa knew someone was in that room with us, and she was right. No, I didn't see anyone. Exactly. The thief was invisible. Invisible? Well, should have seen that coming. I need some air. Let me off. Harry, let me off! Teresa, we'll figure this out. Do you have it? My reward. The golden apple of Hesperides. Uh, uh, no reward without the bounty. This is not Hercules' arrow. It does not have the smell of Hydra's blood. I'm a stealer, not a sniffer. Perhaps you are more sensitive to foul stenches, Cronus. There is one last place the arrow could be. I am not someone you want to disappoint. for a full-fat, half-calf, decaf cappuccino with a hazelnut shot. Then the barista gives me a skinny caramel macchiato. Ah, it's been a while, Teresa. What can I do for you? Oracle, something's affected my powers. Mm. Ah. What do you see? Nothing. I see nothing wrong with your powers. You're sure? Maybe you should look again. Been in this seeing business a long time, and I've never been wrong once. But these voices and... You haven't lost your gift. What you have lost is the ability to see what's staring you right in the face. You should be turning your attention to home. <gasps> home? to make. Ha! Don't tell us! You're the invisible thief that's been stealing arrows. No, I'm not the thief. My son is. Huh? Huh? Your son's the thief? Yes, my little prince of thieves. When he was just knee-high, he could nip a tray of baklava from right under the baker's nose. <laughs> but if Autolycus is the prince of thieves, that makes you... The king. Yep, <laughs> me. I'd probably still be a sneaky cattle stealer if it wasn't for Zeus. Italicus doesn't have any special powers, does he? No, but a helmet is missing from my room. It's one that Autolycus gave to Odysseus to sneak into Troy. The helmet makes you invisible. That's why Teresa had a vision of Hermes. She saw his son. Now about this arrow, I think Cronus has got my boy searching for one of Hercules' arrows. It's coated with Hydra's blood. That stuff's lethal. Teresa's house was on that list. Teresa, we just spoke to Hermes. It's his son that's behind all the robberies. Is he the reason why I've been hearing voices? 
Yeah. Listen, we know where his next target is. My house. Guess it's time you guys met my dad. Hermes, if we catch Atollicus, what should we do with him? Eh. Uh, he's not easy to catch. I wonder if sons of gods get grounded for bad behavior. Teresa! Rather late, isn't it? Dad! These are my friends from school, and we... Uh, uh, we are taking a class in entrepreneurship, so... So, who better than the city's top entrepreneur? Yeah, we want to observe the man behind the money. I mean, machine. Well, sure. All right. Dad makes all his most valuable decisions in here. I'm sure you'll all agree how fascinating leverage buyouts can be towards building market capitalization. <laughs> Dad, my friends want more than the financial picture. You know, hobbies. Like, do you collect stuff? You know, like stamps, coins, Greek weapons? Well, as a matter of fact, uh... What's in that? Huh? Oh. This has been in the family for generations. The story is one war hero passed it on to another war hero. Well, that's all I know. Hercules must have passed it on to your ancestor, Theseus. Oh, excuse me. Yes? Uh, I've got those papers upstairs. Hold on. Okay, now what? We take the arrow back with us. Uh, guys, if this Autolycus is invisible, how do we know he's not in the room already? He's got a point there. He's got the arrow! That just looks weird. What the? Everything all right? I, I heard a crash. Uh, sorry, I, I tripped over my shoelace. I mean, I tripped over his shoelace. Yes, I'm here. Where'd you learn that move? Uh, Hercules. He's my great, great, great. Uh, there's a lot of greats. I taught him that move. Uh, uh, nice try. We should get this back to a safe place. Lost my ability to see what's staring me right in the face. She's <laughs> <laughs> lost it all right. Teresa, what are you? <laughs> help me! Help me! It's alive! Alive! Enough. Oh, no, Gary. <laughs> uh oh. Bottle imps are shapeshifters? Eh, it all depends on who you know. I've got an idea. We're gonna use Cronus's plan against him, and we're gonna need you two. Are you with us? That all depends. What's in it for me? This better be it, or you'll be back in your own time, Autolycus. 
you be the judge. Hmm. Well, it does have a certain pungency. Hercules arrow should be safe here until Hera decides what to do with it. I really thought something was wrong with my powers. You were just cursed with a vengeful, ugly imp. But if it was me, I would have seen right through his buggy disguise. Ah! <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> 